I got married in 2013. Soon after that, um, I took in, I got pregnant, but uh, sometime during the first semester, I had a miscarriage. At the hospital, they realized that I had, or I was told that I had uterine fibroids. And um, the doctor said that wasn't the cause of the miscarriage, but it was just something to watch. And so I tried to just be careful and I took in again some months later, I think this was sometime late 2014, and um, it also didn't go past the first trimester. Again, it was a miscarriage. This time, the doctor uh, that saw me in the hospital here in Lagos said uh, he also did not think it was a miscarriage, but it had grown from the first, uh, the first time it was discovered. And so he continued, I was praying about it, and we were still trying. The third time, again, it was a miscarriage, and at this time I knew that I couldn't just continue leaving things like that. And so we started seeking different medical opinions. I saw doctors across different places, and one of the doctors that came highly recommended to us indicated that the only solution, the permanent solution to the problem would be to have major surgery to take out the fibroids. And so he ran some tests and scheduled a surgery that was uh, somewhere in Calabar. But in my spirit, I really did not feel like going through surgery. And so I called up my mom before running the last set of tests that he had recommended. At this time, I was on drugs to boost my blood level and all that. So I prayed and fasted with my mom for about a week before I went in for the last set of tests, part of which was a HSG, some funny name. And so I ran the tests and the results came out normal. There was actually no need for surgery. During that time, I was praying very intensely. I'm part of the prayer ministry. And there was this morning particularly, I woke up and it was like the devil was trying to shame me with all my friends. He just brought a list of all my friends and the number of kids they had. And I just laughed. And it was, it was a Saturday morning when we had prayers. So I laughed, got ready and came for prayer meetings. And in uh, December 2016, Found, 2015 found out that I was pregnant and this time around the devil just had no hand in it and uh, we had our son August 11, 2016 and he's soon going to be one year. Praise God.